sure. Here's a 4 minute overview of the Jet FC-31 also referred to as the FC-32 or J-35, 2026 version, without brackets or headings, dash dash. The FC-31, also known as the Jer Falcon, is a fifth generation stealth fighter developed by China's Shenyang Aircraft Corporation. It first flew in 2012 and was originally intended to be a carrier-capable fighter for the Chinese Navy. Over time, it evolved into an export-focused model, designed to appeal to countries that cannot acquire the American F-35. Since then, several prototypes have been developed, with improvements in stealth shaping, engines, avionics, and structural design. The design includes twin engines, a single-seat cockpit, internal weapons bays, trapezoidal wings, and twin vertical stabilizers. These features help reduce its radar signature. With an estimated empty weight of around 17,200 kg and a maximum takeoff weight close to 25,400 kg, the FC-31 is expected to reach speeds of up to Mach 1.8. While this makes it slightly faster than the F-35C, it still faces challenges, especially in terms of engine efficiency and thrust-to-weight ratio, as its domestic engines lag behind Western counterparts. The aircraft is equipped with advanced avionics such as an active electronically scanned array AESA radar, electro-optical targeting systems, and data link capabilities that enable sensor fusion. It is built for multi-role capabilities including air superiority, precision strike, reconnaissance, and possibly mid-air refueling. Armament-wise, it can carry PL-10 and PL-15 missiles, along with guided bombs, in both internal and external configurations. The FC-31 is China's main offering for export as a stealth fighter. Pakistan has shown strong interest in the aircraft and is expected to receive the first units around 2027 or 2028. Reports suggest Pakistani pilots are already training in China, and the initial batch could arrive within a year or two. If confirmed, Pakistan would become the first operator of the FC-31, marking a significant shift in regional air power. This acquisition is considered a strategic move that could give Pakistan an estimated 12 to 14 year edge over India's current air fleet, which includes Rafales and Su-30 MKIs. India lacks a fifth generation fighter in operational service, giving Pakistan a potential advantage in air superiority and electronic warfare. This shift is likely to have major implications for regional stability and military planning in South Asia. Despite its strengths, the FC-31 